How to create styles with photos and images in Affinity Photo. Go to the View menu and Studio and Styles to make certain the Styles panel is visible. Go to the toolbar and select a star or ellipse and apply that to the image. The star already contains an image. It could of course be red, green, blue, etc. An image option is not available via the fill. The solution is the gradient tool. Apply a gradient to the shape, go to the top left and select bitmap from the type drop down. The bitmap being an image or photo or tile etc. You can then browse for a particular file, PNG etc. Select a file and then rotate it, scale it, slant it etc. The selected bitmap being one of my antique tile designs. If you want to update it, just go to the bitmap type again. You can then browse for a new file, PNG, JPEG, but not PSD. You can repeat this until you're happy with the design. But the key thing is how to turn it into a style. How can you reuse that style over and over again in future projects? Go to the right side menu of the Styles panel. Go to Add Style from Selection. You now have Style 29 or whatever it's called on your system. Go to Bitmap again and look for another file. A pattern created in an application called Patterno. Go to the Layers panel. Click on FX at the bottom of the panel. The Layer FX panel will now appear. You can now add bevels, shadows, outlines, etc. Add a gradient overlay. Go to the blending modes for the gradient so you can see the image. Select something like difference. You can then see the image again, which is super helpful. You can then change the angle of the gradient, etc. And close the panel. Right click the shape and select the create style. Your new style now appears in the Styles panel. You can now use it in future projects. If you add additional effects such as a new bevel etc. To save the updated style, use Create Style again. There is also a third way of creating a new style to the Styles panel. Go to the Edit menu and Create Style and the style will appear in the Styles panel. Create Style is probably tucked away in another menu. Who knows? You now have your image tucked away in a style, which can be used in future projects. Go and select another bitmap. Go to the Edit menu and Create Style. That image is now saved to your Styles panel. Now to use the styles. I could use a shape, but I'm going to use text. Go to the Text tool. Add an A, fill the screen with the letter by scaling it, apply the style via the Styles panel. All those styles have images included. Hope you found this video of interest. I'm always adding new tutorials about Affinity Photo, so please subscribe. Also, add some comments, a like or dislike. Thank you much.